Let me show you how I've found to mount the Yami Yi, uh, which is a, basically a GoPro uh, clone uh, camera, uh, onto the Isheen uh, 250 FPV racer. Uh, I find this camera absolutely fantastic. Um, it's about £40, which is about $60, and uh, the quality of it is amazing for that. And it's had quite a few knocks, uh, quite a few accidents, and it still bounces back for more. So let me show you how I've found to mount it onto here. Basically, thread a ordinary elastic band through. I found it through this, there's a little slot uh, about a quarter of an inch back, about six mil back. Um, pop it into there. I'm going to mount it so that the camera is, the lens of the camera is center on the actual quad. So it will basically be in line with the uh, FPV camera mounted inside the quad. Uh, you can mount it if you want to, it's entirely up to you. It's only an elastic band that's going to go around. You could mount it so it was central on here, um, but then that's offset. I think it would just look a bit weird. So I prefer to keep the lens central. Make sure you keep hold of the uh, elastic band at the back, otherwise it will disappear under the camera. Just literally slip it around there. Give it quite a tug on the back. Give yourself a little bit of slack and then round it over the top and then literally that's it that's as complicated as I like to get with mounting things um, it works it's absolutely superb um, the nice thing about it being uh, with an elastic band is if the quad takes a really bad hit or the camera takes a hit this is going to happen so it's got a chance to get out of the way uh, I think that's probably why I haven't lost my camera it's never actually held rigidly in it on any of my other quads um, and I've just found it brilliant uh, you can still get to the buttons so that's no trouble at all the other thing with mounting uh, a camera on here when you've got the battery in we keep it out the back here uh, it's pretty pretty balanced actually. Uh, that's about centre point, so that is about centre point. So that's that works really well. If you don't have the camera on, um, you have to slide the battery quite a long way forward. But it still seems slightly heavier on the back end, um, so that actually works quite well as well. So there we go. That's how I do it anyway. Mm -hmm.